Hi friend, it's Ron from cammastery.com where you can go to learn how to make great videos with Camtasia. This is a free lesson Friday, which means you get a free lesson right from my Camtasia Mastery course. If you want to get the entire course, you can head over to cammastery.com slash store and pick up that course. Now onto the video. So you saw how we could import media. We could also go to file and import and grab media that way. But I want to show you another option here that's a little more advanced, and that is connect mobile device. So let me click on connect mobile device. Many of us have information on our mobile phones that we want to be able to use inside Camtasia. So what TechSmith, the company who makes Camtasia, offers is this thing called Fuse. And so this Fuse is an application that we can install on our phones, and then we can connect both our computer and our mobile phone to the same network and be able to transfer files from one to the other. So I want to walk through that now. I've personally never done it. This is going to be the first time I'm doing it. I'm going to walk through it with you myself right now. So it says the first thing to do is install TechSmith Fuse from the Google Play or the App Store. So here's my phone. You can see my notes over here just sitting on my laptop. And I want to search for this TechSmith Fuse app. So I'll try Fuse. And there I see TechSmith Fuse, so I'll grab that. It says it's a free app. I'll install that. Accept. Looks like it's a little over three megs in size. And let's open it. Okay, it says I can scan the QR code found on my favorite TechSmith product to automatically pair the device. That sounds pretty easy. I'll probably do that. And then back here it says access and manage everything from the library tab. Cool. Well, this is the first time I'm looking at it. That sounds good. I see the QR code there. And if I'm looking at my screen, I have the QR code right there on my screen as well. So that sounds good to me. Let's go ahead and try that. I'll click dismiss. All right, so I'll go to my library and I'll go to my gallery. Let's say I want to grab a picture of me and my family. All right, so I want to share that. So I'll try this share button. And I want to share it with Camtasia. All right, connect to Camtasia. File, connect mobile devices, use the scanner to scan the QR code. All right, let's scan that QR code then. There we go. And now it is there on Camtasia. So I selected the one I wanted. I said scan to Camtasia. First time I did it, it didn't work. Um, it just sat there. It had the QR reader and wouldn't do anything. But now it has sent my video over to Camtasia. So there it is. Very cool. Uh, if it doesn't work the first time for you, then just go back and go to connect mobile device and then bring that QR reader back up. So yeah, I just had to try it twice. So right here on my phone, it didn't work when I tried it the first time. Then I just select it again. I said share. I said Camtasia. And then I went back up and then had to scan that QR code. So, oh, and there it is. It just popped back up again. So if you get a cannot connect to server error, you need to turn off your virus protection. So be mindful of what you have in McAfee or in Norton. There might be certain firewall settings or auto protect settings that you may need to disable for a short time and able to make this connection work. So that's how you can get media off of your phone directly into Camtasia.